Uh, in this uh, in this article, I'm going to show you how to uh, import a Word document into a um, into a new post or page. Okay, so you'll see with a Word document, usually there's a bit of a mess um, around it, but I'll just basically give you an example. Uh, so what I do is I copy the Word document, but I never ever use the visual editor. You always copy and paste into the HTML editor. Okay, I'll give you an example of the difference. So you'll see all this code going in there. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove all this. And then I'm going to paste it into there. So you'll see this is nice and clean now. So now, once you've imported it, because I've done it in the HTML editor, it clean, it gets rid of all the code out of it. And the more detailed your Word document, the more code that will be in there. Okay. And I'll just do a quick cleanup. Sometimes you'll notice that the, the text is, is not formatted correctly. So you just got to make sure you get you, you backspace it, make sure it all looks clean. And now what you want, might want to do is you want, might want to bold some of the titles. Okay. Now this is an introduction. So that would be the title. Bring that back. There, I'm not going to uh, publish this because it's not my document. I've got no idea what the document is actually. And then I can actually preview the post. And you'll see it's all there nicely formatted. Okay. Now, um, if you've got images within them, you're just going to have to upload the images with it and then insert the images inside the post. Okay. Um, always make sure you don't, you put it under a category. Uh, but that's pretty much how you do it. You, you always import into the HTML editor, HTML editor and never into the visual editor. Okay, that's how you import a, a WordPress, uh, uh, a WordPress, a WordPress, a, a Word document into WordPress.